so go to precision go conquer i don't want like, you going phase rush until you've played more so like this yeah go like tenacity all... yep and then go uh on the second tree we're going to go the blue tree so sorcery is the blue one yep and you're gonna go uh nimbus which is the top right and celerity which is the middle row yep it's the middle middle yep Right there. Okay, so what did all I just right. give you? So basically, your all-ins are going to be a shit ton stronger, first of all. Like, that's the big thing. Your all-ins going to be a lot stronger, which is going to be really good versus Yorick. Yorick is kind of like a Garen soft counter. But like, you can beat Yorick. The way you beat him is when you all-in, he's going to throw a cage on his head to try to cage you and run away. So as long as you get around that cage, you probably win. Understand? Yeah, I mean, and once I see the ability, I do understand, but... Yeah, if you're... <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> yeah, if you've never seen it, it, it'll be... It'll be pretty... It'll be pretty simple. The big thing is... The lane... When York's pushing into you, you can't do shit. Um, that's the toughest part about this matchup. He's a very good pushing champ. So since you're new right. and you don't know what the champions do, I'll be a little bit more detailed. So all York is gonna do... He's gonna be kind of weak early. But once he hits six, he's going to spawn a giant ass minion. And he's ideally just going to push minion waves into you with his little like ghouls. We have to all in him when his minion wave thins out. That's basically a summary of it. Okay. If you're going to get slowed, if you're going to get feared, if you're going to get stunned, if you're going to get binded, if you're going to get rooted, if you see it about to hit you, tap W right before it hits you. Think about it as like reflecting it. I would just go to lane. But the key with it, though, is it's like, like right there, you would have pressed W right before that hits you, that bind. Uh, yeah. I like, what do you mean? Uh, the like, Morgana bind. bind. Like, watch, watch. W, like, you would W right before it hits. Okay, yeah, 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 okay. And that would reduce the bind duration for a long time. Your team is trolling. What the fuck? Yeah, I mean, this is, this is like almost every game. <laughs> so, <laughs> I mean, it is, it is. Sometimes you're lucky and sometimes you're not <laughs> lucky. All right, now let's do our thing. So yeah. early lane, um, you are allowed to hit him. So you can walk up and like auto minions with him and then you can auto queue him. I, I think you've seen my coaching before where I talk about auto queue. Wow, run away. He ignited us. That was very, okay. Was, we're very, we're in very new, very new ELO, aren't we? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> walk up and auto queue him again this, and this... then run away. All right, back up. Minions are going to target you, so run back to tower. Yeah. Touching the bush is good, too. That's good, too. Yeah. Now, um, since he's going to get level two first, just chill out and let him come to you. You're going to see the ability in a second. That right there. Did you see him throw it at you? Yeah, so, so just auto them? Yeah, you kind of... I mean, you can auto-queue. You can auto-queue them, but yeah, you really would rather just run away, I think. Okay. Kind of like kite him out. When you go up to the wave to farm, if you haven't seen him throw that E in a while, sidestep. Okay. Now he doesn't have that ability, but he has his cage now. See the cage? Yeah, I tried to get out of it, but. Well, the way, the way it works is you can auto it a few times, but it's best to just not get caged. Like, it's a shitty ability to get hit by. Okay. I mean, I'm now, just, you have the yeah. wave. You have the wave at your back. So, technically, if you can get up to him and QE, like right now, I would walk up. Oh, shit. Okay, back up first. Now, he caged. So, you can walk up to him now and try to pressure him with auto Q. All right, just back uh, up and use your pot. Keeps. Yeah, that's good. That's fine. Okay, walk up and E the wave now since he used his E. Yep, yeah, that's fine. E the wave. There you go. Now slow push, which means just last hit at the very last second while guarding your minions. He has no mana, so you can auto queue him at any time. So, yeah. 
and go back to slow pushing. You just block my minions now and don't Yep, literally, get literally just, yes. You literally just last hit. Try to aim, like, for the last second. Like, really be precise about it. Auto queue him. You're not afraid of him at all. He has no mana. Yeah, exactly. You just kind of guard and make sure, yep, Q. Back away. That was fine. And then go back to slow pushing. Don't E it. Don't E the wave. Turn it off. Turn it off. Uh, okay. uh, you want to E him, but not the wave. Keep guarding your okay. minions, too. You see how he's farming in front of you? Don't let him farm. Auto Q, E. Oh, you could have uh, E the shit out of him. Yeah. Uh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It's all good. It's how you learn. It's just... I was just trying to hold my... Yeah, no, hold my you're I good. just level E, right? Yeah, 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 E. I just, I just keep on leveling E. Yeah. Now, wait for the next wave, and then we're going to hard push. So, there's a wave on your mini-map. If you look at your mini-map, you'll see... Oh, he's still here. What the fuck? Slow push, then. Walk up. Q at him. Yeah. Oh, he's... <laughs> he just... What? Uh, this guy is so funny. I like this guy. Okay, so walk <laughs> up and auto E the wave. So, normally I tell people auto, auto E or some variation of that. Now get in the bush and press B. Yes, yeah, perfect. Good job. That was good. What do I get here? Like, I would go boots, attack speed dagger. Probably boots, double attack speed dagger, actually. Undo that and go boots and double dagger. Yep. Refill? No, no, boots. Oh, yeah, go, sorry, go, I thought right. I really bought the boots. No, you're yeah, good, you're yeah. good, you're sorry. good, you're good, you're good. Yeah, yeah. I just fucking, yeah. The yeah, undo like yeah. Oh, that was the wrong button. Now remember the wave's huge, right? So you're just stealing farm here. Okay, this is the hard part. So he puts a big wave under tower. Sit back, sit back, sit back, sit back. You can't tank it. You can't tank it. There you go. You can auto these. You can auto those. Yep. So what do I do now? In this Just wait. You need to keep your health high and like sit back. Okay. I can't. Farm you can auto. You can auto those. You can. You can farm. It's just if he's pressuring you with the wave under tower, you'll lose a lot of health. Okay. Mix in your Q. Yeah. And you can use your E as well. You can like legit like toggle it and turn it off. That's what I do. Don't clear it fast though. Just slow push from here. Yep. Slow push and guard. Now I would try to trade. I would try to uh, trade onto him here. Yep. Hit that thing. Auto like go auto Q it, and then E. Ah, okay. If you're gonna auto Q something, like the wave or no. But I'm saying if you're gonna auto Q an enemy champion or an enemy like pet like that, you need to get your E off because right now every time you've auto queued, you haven't used your E. Okay. So walk up, auto Q. You have the wave, so E. It. Yep. And hit this thing as much as you can. Because that is his ult. If you could put that on cooldown, it's a huge cooldown. Okay? Okay. Think of it as like a mini boss. So... I'd reset. I don't really know what we can do here. Buy Berserker Greaves and run right back to top quick. Run, 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 run. It's a pushing lane. Like, he's going to push into you a lot like this, so... You got to be quick. Okay. Spam your Q and try to get us there as fast as you can. The good news is that the turret will target the ghouls first, giving you time to catch up. See? You won't really lose anything. Oh, yeah. Remember, slow push from here. Because if, if you push too fast, you'll never be able to kill this guy. When you see that you're not going to be able to kill with the standard auto, you need to mix in an auto queue because you're dropping too much farm. Like, you can okay. kind of tell the difference between, like, 
when I'm gonna be able to auto to clear a minion and when the turret's gonna fuck it up. So if the turret's gonna fuck it up, think, oh, maybe I can auto queue this or maybe E it, right? <laughs> That's how you get the crazy farm that I get. I'm lagging. Yeah, it's okay. I saw it. It's fine. It goes out and in sometimes. Now walk up and queue him oh, and then try to E. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He's just igniting me again. <laughs> All right, pull back to tower. You're fine. Cool. You survived a gank. That's good. Auto and back up. Auto and back up. Auto and back up. It's better to just auto. Yeah. Okay. I'll pull the wave back. So just like auto XP range. Pull, get right behind the tower though, because you don't want to get hit by shit. Yeah. Now farm and auto these ghoulies. Yep. There, I would have used E if I knew I wasn't going to get it. Like that as okay. well. Yep. <laughs> I would hit that. Oh, never mind. Back up. This is what I meant when I said it's kind of hard to find windows versus him when you're new. Yeah, yeah. That makes sense. Sit back extra, extra far back. Okay, he lost his he lost his ult, so that's important. <laughs> Level up your E. And that would be a Q, auto Q. Yeah, it makes yeah, it makes sense. Now, <clears throat> I would go for a hard shove and a reset. So auto, auto E. Yep. I get in the bush and reset. Sweet. Yeah, when you're new, it's really fucking tough to find a window to kill this guy. He's just he just pushes into you, and like I said, he's kind of a soft counter too. Grab a pickaxe, pickaxe. I want the AD. Yeah, let's go. <clears throat> yeah, our opponent keeps igniting us. It's pretty funny. All right, so yeah. pull the wave back. And now use this cage for some reason. Yeah, keep bottling. Walk up, walk up. EM. Sweet. All right, let's go back and push. Cool. That was a good job. I mean, you're doing better than most new players. You went and tried to kill somebody. That's something. You followed a gank, right? Let's push. Let's push, push, push. Like, is it wrong for me to, to like, use my, um, my, uh, my flash there? No, no. I think it's fine. It's, the thing is, it's so awkward to find the, the way to walk up to York without, like, getting slowed or getting caged. It's just tough. Auto, you need to auto queue. Okay. I was just waiting for the way. Now, there, now right? leave, now yeah, leave, leave, leave. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. So, you so wouldn't back yet? No, I'm gonna try to push the next wave if I'm you. Okay. So what you're gonna do is the next wave is gonna come out. You're gonna confidently walk up and auto auto e the wave and e him. So walk up, yeah, yeah, e everything. You see how you dodge the cage? That's really good. Try to push the wave in and then leave. Keep pushing. Consider the wave just like a chore. Now run, 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 run. We did it. Yeah. Get behind tower, quick. Get behind tower. Don't even fuck with him. So what we're trying to do is we're trying to find a time that we can back. Okay. Okay. And we can can we back now or I mean we probably shouldn't. Let's just stay for now. We're not gonna be doing much anyways to him. Until we have ignite. So pull the wave back, let it come under tower. E the whole thing. Auto the big one. If he if he ever leaves it like that, try to auto the big one. 
Yeah, I, I saw it. Walk up and late. try to shove. Try to shove so you get a back timing. Okay. Oh, okay, Oops, go push. Uh, fuck it, fuck it, push. Just push. Auto, auto, E, yeah. Remember, League is all about minion waves. Go ahead and get in this bush and press B. See how you did this chore? He can't do anything now until he does his chores. You see this? Oh, oh yeah, yeah, because he needs his wave. So you've got to grab your items quick. Yeah, grab quick and go get out there fast, fast, fast. The idea is that if he's, if he's stuck doing that, he's not pushing your tower. And you can back. See how you have enough yeah, time to, to get there? Keep spamming Q. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Makes a lot of sense. Because now, like, yeah, his wave is first. Is here now, then. But... Now go up there and E him. Just E everything. Get him off of your tower. Now push hard. You've got your whip, so I would auto, auto, E and just push everything. See that? Now you're allowed to take a plate. His back timing wasn't as good as ours, you see? Yeah, but there's no plate left. But yeah, I know. Yeah. So you just auto queue, hurry, get it done quick. Make sure to auto queue. If you're going to queue, wait for the auto to land. Now E all this. Now I would legit, I would just leave and grab your stride breaker. He's got to deal with the wave. Stride breaker. And then build towards mortal. Good, good, good. Let's go. Get out there quick. You can just build whatever. Yeah, whatever's the most uh, pricey. All right, let's start trying to duel now. <clears throat> So the way we do this is, again, if he's got that Maiden and a huge wave, we might lose to him. So try to find a spot where he doesn't have a lot I of minions. My... You can just clear the wave and start pushing at him right now. He backed down. Clear it. Just clear it quick before he gets on it. There you go. Skip over him. Don't chase him. Skip over him and push. That's the best thing you can do. Just, just keep moving. Okay. And remember, auto, auto, E. Because if he tries to fight you while you have a wave pushing, you just win. Nice try. Whatever. Keep moving. I think he's on rift right now, actually. You know what the rift okay. is? The thing yeah. below you? Yeah. Yeah, I mean, I'm, auto, I'm auto new, e. but I, I know, like... Yeah, yeah. Uh, I just... I think it's worth for us to ignore him. Just hit the tower. Hit the tower. I think he's actually doing rift. Auto Q. Oh, no. He's bad. Cool. So, back up. Oh. Okay. He's doing that again. <laughs> Now go to the bush below you and wait. Now you can sneak around him. Hug the wall and sneak around him. Yeah. And just run up at him. Trade and run away with stride breaker. Like Q at him and like trade and run away. Yeah. That's fine oh, if you get caught up. You might get caught for a bit and then we'll just run. Yeah. Spam Q. Spam Q. See, you see how he like surrounded us with a bunch of minions? Yeah. Like when you trade, that's the that's what I was talking about with York particularly. Just wait until you heal up and just sit back. Don't take any free damage. Just sit back because you'll heal up really fast. So I'll just just yeah, wait. Just, yeah, just his, wait. Uh, yep. range thingy. Just yeah. don't let him hit you with any range shit. So that took you out of your passive just now, fighting those ghouls. I would have not even touched them. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I didn't think about that, of course. Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. So just sit back. Let your healing run. You see that green thing above your passive, like above your uh, HUD? Like at the top? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That, when that's on, that means it's running. All right, let's go fight him. Go fight him. He just used everything. Q at him. Yeah, now E. There you go. You can ignite him, and then Q ult. Well, I have to use my... Yeah. Okay. Just I in was, case. I was trying just in not case. to use my ult here. Yeah, just in case he gets away, right? Yeah. 
Also, just a little bonus tip. Like, yeah, it's good to save ults. But also remember, like, the longer you take to kill somebody, the more that we could have been just pushing waves. Yeah, that makes sense. I would have actually got a little more money by just holding him immediately. Then. Yes, that's what I'm trying to say. You're yes. Saving it. Yeah, yeah. That's why, like, it's it's kind of a finicky decision to make. Oh, you could fight him. I wouldn't run. He's level 11. I would auto him. Auto him. Fight him a bit. See where it goes. Now, E. Don't run. Don't run. Trust me. Just. Yep. You got Stride Breaker? If you oh, fought yeah. him a little bit more confident, I think it goes a little bit better. But the other thing is, just in general, I want you never, like, anybody lower level than you, I never want to see you immediately run okay as, as a start point now grab what you can towards mortal just go to chop immediately or just go I think I would go bottom bottom yeah like yeah the there's option. no well it's because it's because the wave is right there and no one's on it and i just move to the closest resource usually okay a little lag I'm lagging right now yeah, yeah, yeah that's why i've been hidden by the way it comes in and out skips. Now, until I knew where more were, I would sit in this bush. I would just sit until I knew what was happening on the map. Like, look at the map. Right now, you're invisible. You may as well not even exist, okay? When you're in this bush, like, no one can see you. No one knows where you are. Okay. Now, look at Miss Fortune. We got Miss Fortune. We got York Top. Let her push into you. For all you know, they push up and they try to push past you, right? So just give it a second. Yeah, yeah. Until oh, you show, geez. now you can go up there. Go up there. Push out. Go try to fuck them up. Now, York's pushing our top. We're going to have to deal with that. So go and uh, E this whole wave quickly. Use your stride breaker. Oh, vote no. Vote no, by the way. Press B. I buy your items quick. Buy a long sword. All right, let's go. Now run out there and E. We queued for ranked, right? This isn't a norms game, is it? It's what? This is a ranked game, right? Keep pushing out. Keep pushing out. Yeah, yeah this is a uh, ranked game. This is ranked, okay. Cl clear that thing. Damn. Uh, that's right. If you had pushed out faster, you would have caught him. Yeah, of course. Remember, Garen is all about, like, speed pushing after, after like, lane phase. Keep moving forward. Straight line. And spam your Q. York's bottom, so I'm taking this tower. Don't don't leave. You've got an open goal right now. That's what I call this. Okay, back up. Get in this bush below you. I'm turning on him. If he's chasing, turn on him. Uh, stride breaker. Yep. Use your ignite. And then ult. Ult and you would have won. You would have won. Oh, yeah, yeah. I see that. Though. Don't chicken out. Don't chicken out. Trust the levels. Trust the levels. It doesn't matter if he's stronger than you. Uh, you should go, by the way, when you're new, you should just go Stride Breaker third. Or not Stride Breaker, I'm sorry, Hull Breaker. Misspoke. Yep. Um, yeah. This just makes okay. you better on split pushing and gets you used to hitting towers. Yeah, stop chickening out. I know you think that guy is like, I mean, he's fed, like he has gold. But you need to play like you beat him. Like you can't ever, you can't, when you're fighting people, you can't fight cowardly. Like that's, that's the worst saying, thing you I do. Would, I would, 
Yeah, but I see what you're saying, because I would 100% have beaten him if I used my ult there. Yeah, you're just scared because he's dealing a lot of damage, and you're like, oh god, I'm losing. Don't worry about that yeah. right now. Trust the stats. Like, I have higher level, I'm gonna fight. And that's how you need to think. Fight confidently. Okay. Do I defend here, or just No, go... I just push. I work map. With new players, I always have new players pushing and dueling, pushing and dueling. Okay. I would oh, run up and if, yeah, I would fight him. I would fight him. I'm not afraid of him. Get him. Stridebreaker, don't let that thing leave. Beat it up. Yeah, hit it. Keep hitting it. Spam Q after it. Yeah. Now E. E, E, E. Now I would get in this bush behind you and assess again until I knew, no, behind, in lane. Never go through the jungle. Never go through the jungle. Okay. You're just bumping into people. That's all you're doing. You know the lanes yeah, behind they're... the lane behind you is clear. They could be on Baron. Let's walk down and maybe ward. Just throw it into the Baron pit and then we'll go back to top. Now let's go back to top. Just wait for him to Yeah, yeah. I would wait. Oh. Yeah, okay, I'm sorry. You could have yeah, let him push yeah, by I'm... you and then Yeah. yeah. He yeah, just yeah, it. he knows you're there now. This is like this is like bad hiding. Oh fight him. He's three levels behind. Fight him. Fuck it. Use your whip. Use your whip. You need to use that right away. That's slow. Now kite back. Yeah. You need to kite back and wait for your E. Kite back. Now you E it all. Let's keep pushing. Walk up and auto Q whip and then run away. Try it. And then you could have eat as well. Just for like the extra damage. Yeah, but I just want yeah, you to see that yeah. you can harass people under tower. <clears throat> now I would just eat the whole wave. I would eat everything. Level your ult. <clears throat> now the real advanced move. Walk under tower. <clears throat> oh, never mind. Run away. Just run away. Because you got Soraka there. Spam Q. Spam Q when running. Yep. Let's get in this bush and reset. Bush. Yep. Yes, you can also whip while spinning. Chat thinks you might not know that. I don't know. I think you do know that. You know, I'm just like listening to you at the same time just makes me... No, no. You're good. You're good. I understand. All right, sell the so door and shield. Yep, up. yep. Let's go bottom. Work bottom. All right, so let's explain what Hullbreaker does. When you're by yourself, you get bonus armor, magic resist, and your minions are stronger. That's basically the summary, okay? Okay. It's a split push item. I like split pushing a lot. That's why I have you have this item. Keep pushing. Yeah, that makes... Uh... You want to push as fast as you can? And then maybe we defend with Kane, but it's pretty, I don't know. It's pretty hard. There's two dead. Let's just push as fast as we can while watching mid. So move your camera to mid. You say you play Starcraft, right? There you go. Now they get the inhib. We can't stop that. Clear this first. E it. Whip. Camera to mid. Your Kane's like running it down in mid. All right, keep pushing, keep pushing. We're going to give inhib. But keep juggling that camera to mid. Because you got to judge when we're going to back. Yeah. yeah. Get your camera on mid. You got to do both. On the mid. No, yeah, there you go. Watch and see what they do. Keep pushing. Back to us. Yeah, good, good, good. Hit this tower. Break it as fast as you can. Go break it. Go break it. Break it and then run away with W and Q, okay? And leave. Run, 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 run. Yep. Yep. Just keep running until Pantheon leaves you alone. Spam your Q. Good. Straight line. No crooked movement. And now you know since they've... Oh, they're chasing you from above us. Just keep running. Yep. Just keep running. Keep running. They're dumb. They're being really noobish right now. Okay. Now you can press B. Good job. So even though they got a tower and an inhib, we at least got rid of their tower at bottom and we got stronger than anybody else on the map with that. 
You could have left. You were fine. Uh, stride breaker. Yeah. You can all early here. You have 16. Uh, yeah. You should have all did it a long time ago. There you go. No, now, I would press, press. I would. No, 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 no. Get in the bush and press B. You got a York to defend top. I just wanted the money. Yeah, yeah. No, I, I don't blame you. Um, <clears throat> next item you should get. Go ahead and buy uh, black cleaver. Buy it. Quick, 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 quick. Buy, buy, buy. Go, go, go. Get to top. You don't have ult, but you can definitely defend the wave. Ping on the way. Yeah, let's go. E this shit. Kill that thing. Kill that fucking thing. Don't let that thing leave. Chase it. Cue it. Fuck that thing up. There you go. Keep pushing the lane hard after you take care of this thing. Right, keep pushing. Yep. Uh, you could probably, I mean, we could, we could definitely push this. Put a ward below us. Yep. Let's try to knock this tower down. E, E to get rid of the wave quick. Yep. Don't be shy. She's level 12. You're level 17. Stop being a pussy. Like get up there. She can't do anything. You're very strong. Not, you don't have to dive her. Just hit the tower a bit. Yep. There yeah. you go. I'll All right. Just, just back away. Run back. It's just more important in those sequences to hit tower. Like, her, she doesn't even do anything at that point. She can't even hurt you. Now, um... It's a 2v4, so just resetting is probably best for Black Cleaver. Alright, grab your Black Cleaver quick. Get out on the map fast. Q. You kind of want to fight if you can. Yeah, let's go out there and fight. Normally, when you're running up to a fight, you don't queue, if that makes sense. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. Get out there. Get out there. Get out there. Get out there. Q. E. Just E. 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 She's shrouded. Just E. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now go to Dragon. They might be on it, so you gotta fight them. Right there. Oh, you get it yeah. for free. Nice. Yeah, when you see her shroud like that, uh, E, there's a good chance that she'll get hit by it. Yeah, that makes sense. They're actually, yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Now, let's go to bottom. Oh, I kill that misfortune. I just go kill her. Yeah, she can't do anything. You literally just Q and stride break her and she's dead. Uh, Kane has it. Oh, never mind. Help him, help him, help him. Stride breaker, stride breaker for the slow. Now go bot, push bot. Yeah, keep pushing, keep pushing hard. Now I'm trying, if I'm you, I'm assist pinging Baron a bunch and trying to get my team to move to Baron. There you go. Go fight this Akali. She's on your left. You can see her. Yeah, go fuck her up. Yeah, I was... I saw her. I was yeah, yeah. Sure, it's it's Soraka. It's Soraka. Pushing. Soraka. Soraka. Q. And you stride break her. As soon as you get close... Oh, wow. She fucking... She flashed right away. You can still catch her. She's slow as fuck. The first thing you do is stride break her right there. There you go. As soon as you're, like, even close to her, stride break her right away. Okay. Keep, keep pushing. You're sense. really strong right now. Yep. Eat this whole thing. Hit it in him, in him. I'd try breaker and kill her. Like, let's try. Make sure you queue for it though. I would take it and leave. Yeah. And run. Queue away. Nice. Go to the bush and lane and then reset. Nice. Dope. Okay, GA is your next item. GA. Type GA in the search. That'll do it for you. Right there, Guardian Angel. 
Yeah, buy the BF sword and then buy a red pot. You know what that is? The elixir of, uh, it's right on the left side. Yeah, elixir of wrath. Yep. And what that does, I, are these new to you, the pots? No, no. I don't, I don't, usually whatever, I only buy the, the iron one, like the... Well, this one's one. flat AD. The, the, the health one's pretty good, but I've been just going AD more because it just feels better to actually pot people. Oh, hello. We got a pantheon in our jungle. I think I would clear this mid first. Keep, push the next wave after. Push the next wave first. Yeah. That way, whatever we do, we don't lose the game, okay? Because that's all it is. It just yeah. changes what's at stake. We're not afraid of her. Yeah, exactly. Run it. I love it. Try to stride breaker when you get close. Then spam your E. There it is. You saw her. You see her. You see that? Nice. Eat up this misfortune. You're huge. You can fight them. You're huge. You can literally fight them. You can kill them. They can't do anything. I promise. It, it all comes down, it comes down to levels. Once you have such a level lead, you can basically start doing crazy shit. At least until your opponents get better. Okay. Yeah, I try to end. Or at least break a tower. At least break a tower. I don't know if yeah. you can end yet, but you can get a lot done. Try the next one. You have W. Don't go too deep. If we die, it's going to fucking hurt. Yeah. We're going to lose a lot if we die. Because, um, get in the bush and reset so I can explain. So, what's going to happen is, if you die, look how your score line is right now. The way League's designed is basically, if you're fed like this, your death timer's longer. Remember, it's GA. Yep. I would run right down mid and push first, as fast as you can. Uh, do I have to press anything on this one, or is it just like the only no, it's, all, it's automatic. It just... it just goes when you die. So when you die, you revive. That's all GA is. Okay. I'm pushing right down mid and trying to. I, I might even flash on her head in Q. E and then I'll. Ooh. Try to try to oh, uh, stride breaker. Uh, Q after Q Q Q Q Q. Remember that your Q and your stride breaker is everything. Go ahead and eat the wave so we have it at our back. Like, what is the timing on those things? Like, the stopwatch and... You stuff? just get used to it. You just get used to it. It'll be okay. like muscle memory. You'll you'll get used to it. It never changes or anything. I would let the wave do the... Oh, okay. Go ahead. If you can kill her, go ahead. Nah. Yeah. Yeah. She has to have lower health. It's based on missing health. Hit the tower, hit the tower. Now, technically you can hit base a little bit. Just save your Q and your W. Now Q away. Oh, yeah. Q away? Yeah. Good. Yeah, just leave. Leave, leave, leave. You're good. Just. I mean, hovering is okay, but I would rather like, I would rather think about what our next objective is. So hold to, uh, I guess, I mean, I guess you could shove mid again, whatever. As long as you don't get caught, really. Because getting caught means our death timer is going to be fucking massive. Run down mid and act for a second like you're going to end, but just like fake it. Like, yeah, yeah, there you go. Just mind game it. Yep. And then assist ping Baron. That's how you're going to stop this like stalemate. Yep. Yep, just ping it from time do to time. Do I go there? No, 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 no. no. Keep or? it pushing. We will when they move. We will when they move. It's just they're not moving it, right? So... Keep assist pinging it. Maybe put the pings on their head, maybe? Because sometimes they're lock screen players. Right? Like, like they don't they don't see past their screen. Hey, you can go after it. Yep. She's in there. Just stride breaker as you get close. And that'll stop her back. See? Now push, okay, push, push. Would, yeah. Yeah. Makes sense. So the stride breaker is longer range than anything else you have, right? So. Like, when you're queuing, go ahead and use it and look at the, the animation of the stride breaker. You'll see what I mean. It's like really far, you see? It's farther than your E. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, go end. E the whole thing and end. 
Oh, can I? Uh, yeah, I know you said to end, but that's like. Uh, you could have poked that? it. You could have poked at it. Like, now is this ping Baron again? And like, remember, put your pings on their head, on their head, on their head, on the mini map. Like, yes. They're lock screen players. They don't know. Now let's walk up. This is they're not listening. Let's walk up and try to end now. Yeah, but I'm lagging right now, so I can't really. You get you. Once your lag ends, you have GA. So, oh there. I guess we win. Nice. Yeah, so I never died basically. Well, I died, I get, <laughs> if you what, died, yeah, you had you had re you had revive. We were good. Yeah. So, um, I mean, obviously you've played uh, other real-time strategy games. I think that's clear because you're like moving your camera around. You have no problem with that element, right? Which is really good because a lot of players like they can't fucking do that at all. You understand? Like they really struggle with juggling all that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, okay. I mean, the main thing there is just getting you to understand, like, if you've got levels on people, limit tests. Like, have fun with the game at that point. 